even though I've been lucky enough to be able to be a part of the Drop Liaison program, where I get the opportunity to review things that Drop sends me, this review of the DCX Green Marble keycap set is not part of that program. Drop did not tell me to review this, and they did not send me the set for free. I paid for it with my own money. And I don't get any sort of kickback or benefit from doing this review from Drop. I was simply excited to try Drop's first DCX PBT set, and I wanted to share my thoughts. Also, know that these are just my personal opinions. And as we all know in our hobby, your preference and what you enjoy takes precedence over what others may think. Our opinions may not align, and that's fine. Earlier this year, Hoff wrote an article about the differences between DCX, DCD, and DCL. On top of being a great read, I was very intrigued that DCX had an option for PBT, especially double shot PBT. While there weren't any PBT DCX sets until the release of this keycap set, DCX Green Marble, the thought of having an in-house double shot PBT option had my attention. I've had many ABS DCX sets as well as a few DCD sets, and in terms of the keycaps in general, I have a good balance of ABS and PBT sets in my collection. But it had been some time since I actually had a double shot PBT set. I only had DICE PBT up until a DCX Green Marble shipped, so I can't necessarily compare DCX Green Marble to any other double shot PBT keycap set. But I'll do my best comparing it with the PBT DICE subsets that I have, namely JCS Arabic, XMI Vintage, CRP Round 6, and DCD 100 Acres. I hope that the DCX PBT line continues for reasons that I'll talk about in the rest of my review, but I think Drops got a winning idea here with PBT Double Shot DCX offerings. I'll cheat a little here and refer back to the Geek Hack review I wrote on DCD 100 Acres compared to JCS, XMI, and CRP sets that I mentioned before in case there are people interested in thickness measurements and digital microscope pictures with a link to that written review as well as the album of pictures with the measurements in the video description. I know my digital calipers aren't perfectly accurate, but at least you can see the comparison between keycap sets and which are thicker or thinner than others, if you care about that stuff. While it's a bit more difficult to compare between the sets since all but green marble are based off of beige, the crispness and boldness of the DCX green marble set is pretty good. No blurriness either. But again, green marble is the only double shot PBT set that I have, and the other four are die sub, so take that into consideration. In terms of thickness, DCX green marble is middle of the pack. Not the thickest, and not the thinnest when compared to the other four sets. But arguably the most important thing for most people is how keycap sets look. The uniqueness of DCX Green Marble with the no two sets will share the same marbly look is a big selling point. On top of that, something that I personally was surprised about was that the set wasn't low contrast, meaning that the legends were not hard to see even though they're in white on a green background. As someone who doesn't necessarily enjoy blanks or low contrast sets, that's a benefit for me. Even though I do touch type, I look down at my keyboard every now and then. And another huge selling point, the set looks even better in person compared to the pictures. As y'all know, renders are not 100% accurate, so it's nice to see that the actual keycat set itself looks just as good if not better than the renders. At least under my lighting. It definitely is a conversation starter as well, with many of my coworkers remarking how they like the look of the finishing. If you think you like the sets based off of the pictures alone, I don't think you'll be disappointed. In terms of sound between the five sets, Here's a sound test video that I recorded.
Yes, we all know that sound tests aren't necessarily accurate, even if your actual setup is as accurate as it can be, since we can all hear differently. But at the very least, you'll be able to tell which keycaps are higher pitched compared to others, and which are lower pitched. To my ears, DCX Green Marble was the highest pitched set between the other four, DCD 100 Acres, CRP Round 6, XMI Vintage, and JCS Arabic. It's not as high pitched as GMK or Kikobo to my ears, but DCX Marble definitely is a tad brighter sounding than my dice subsets. I wouldn't classify DCX Green Marble as textured by any means, but it's also not completely smooth. There's just enough grip on the keycaps to where your fingers aren't sliding everywhere when typing. Although, if you have very sweaty fingers, you may disagree with me. But they aren't as smooth as CRP Round 6, which is the smoothest PPT set I have. But overall, all five keycap sets feel very similar. Overall, I'm very happy with the look of the keycap set, the sound, and the feel. Personally, I put more stock into aesthetics than anything else when it comes to buying keycaps. And while I did have concerns that the legends may be hard to see because of them being on a green background and them being in white, I'm glad to report that for me, it was a non-issue. I was able to use the minimum 30% off Drop Keyboard Club coupon on the $79 pre-order price to get the set for $58 shipped. And for that price, I think it's well worth it for a double shot PBT set. Are there cheaper double shot PBT sets? Absolutely. But none that I know have the same marbly look. So this is an easy recommendation for me for those that want a higher pitch PBT set and love the look, especially if you have a 30% DKC coupon or higher to use. But honestly, it all depends on how much you're willing to pay for double shot PBT keycaps, as well as how much you're willing to pay for keycaps in general. For me specifically, I don't even buy GMK for $99. So if I had to pay $99 without a coupon for DCX Green Marble, I probably wouldn't. It's just that for me personally, I don't usually buy anything north of $99 unless it's a set of a designer that I want to support, like James or Diego, or for some other reasons, whether it's ABS or PBT. Thanks everyone, and catch you in the next video.